In the summer of 2007, the calm atmosphere of Dnipropetrovsk, Ukraine's fourth largest city, was shattered. Residents, once carefree, were now gripped by a chilling fear. Over the course of 21 harrowing days, three local teenagers launched a killing spree, taking 21 innocent lives. The horror didn't stop at the crimes themselves. The trio documented their actions in what are now considered among the most haunting videos the internet has ever seen. Today, we take a look at the gruesome story of the Dnepropetrovsk maniacs. From a young age, Viktor Sayenko and Igor Supernyuk displayed disturbing tendencies, like torturing animals and photographing their vile acts. Alexander Hansa, initially a bystander, soon became an accomplice. The descent of the three young boys was marked by signs like slipping grades and violent tendencies in school. Their twisted bond deepened in their teenage years as they challenged each other's fears, leading to unsettling acts like hanging over a 14th floor balcony and torturing stray dogs in the woods. The Dina Propetrovsk maniac's reign of terror began on the evening of June 25, 2007. 19-year-old Sayenko and 19-year-old Suprunyuk were going for a walk when they saw 33-year-old Yekaterina Ilchenko, who was on her way home from a friend's house. When Ilchenko walked by, Suprunyuk suddenly hit her on the side of the head with a hammer, leaving her dead body on the sidewalk. Within less than an hour after killing Ilchenko, the two men killed their next victim, Roman Tatarevich, who was asleep on a bench nearby. Tatarevich was bludgeoned to death with the same hammer as the one that killed Ilchenko. In the next 11 days, five more unsuspecting victims were brutally killed. On July 7th, a glimmer of hope appeared when 14-year-old Vadim Lyakov survived a brutal attack in which his friend, 14-year-old Andrei Sidiuk, was killed while fishing. Lyakov assisted the police by creating sketches of the attackers, eventually leading to a breakthrough in the case. Sadly, before the police were closing in, a string of horrible killings followed at the hands of the gruesome trio. Since murder wasn't enough, the maniacs started to capture their horrifying deeds in homemade snuff films. The most notorious video was called Three Guys, One Hammer, and was leaked onto the internet. The video details the chilling murder of 48-year-old Sergei Yatsenko, showing the entire attack that lasts around four minutes. A short side note for the viewers who are curious about this video. Don't watch it, we haven't. If only out of respect for the victim and his loved ones. In the days that followed, 12 more victims were killed at the hands of the maniacs. It looked like that they were picked at random and were often easy targets like kids, the elderly, and the homeless. Most of the victims were hit with blunt objects, and often the blows were aimed at their faces, making them impossible to recognize. On July 23, 2007, the three men were finally apprehended. Suprunyuk's attempt to pawn a victim's phone led to their capture when the phone's location was pinged. While Suprunyuk and Sayenko were arrested at the pawn shop, Anza was arrested at home after trying to flush other stolen phones. At their trial, the evidence was overwhelming, showcasing the blood-stained clothes of the suspects, over 300 photographs, and two disturbing videos. On February 11, 2009, the court of Dnipro, chaired by Judge Ivan Senchenko, found Sayenko guilty of 18 murders. Suprunyuk was found guilty of 21 murders. Since Ukraine has not carried the death penalty since 2000, they both received a life sentence. Hanja, believed to have only filmed the crimes, was handed a nine-year term for two robberies. Today, Supranyuk and Sayenko are still alive and in jail. Hanja was freed from prison in 2019 after serving nine years. He is now married with two kids. Thanks for joining us for this chilling tale of the Dine Propetrovsk maniacs. Share your views in the comments and please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more stories about serial killers worldwide. You can also check out our other videos for more intriguing stories. Until next time and stay safe.